now let's go ahead and uh, download the source code so for that first we need to create a directory for that i will switch back to the terminal and create a directory first okay let's get into that directory okay so i am now inside that now let's configure git username okay so now similarly copy um, set the email okay so i am done with the git initialization so now the next step is actually to initialize the repo so we are going to download one particular branch so we should use this second uh, second command so i'll just copy this part and just paste it over here and our branch um, we are going to pick up uh, the 12 branch the latest one that we should pick it up from this tag from here so we'll take the latest okay and just paste that here and just enter so it's downloading the uh, it's basically initializing the uh, repository so this will be pretty fast and after that we need to run repo sync which will actually download the repository so i think this will be done in another couple of minutes yeah so the repo is now initialized so now we need to just type repo sync so here you can give the number of um, the logical course you have got and this is going to take um, a lot of time uh, i guess at least one hour it will take and depending upon your machine and the internet connection it's going to take uh, the time accordingly so once this is done we will go ahead and uh, build the repo so that will again take another one and a half hour i guess so uh, in total uh, you would need at least um, three to four hours to um, to download the source and build it okay